Good morning there. How are we doing today? So IRL is 3.42 p.m. and I've already eaten for the day. Uh, I posted what I ate yesterday in the comments in yesterday's video. I'm sorry for the audio. This one should be better. Yeah, 100% should be better. There should be no reoccurring issues other than potentially there being a loud intro. Today I had six ounces of ground beef. It was seasoned. I had six ounces of chorizo, two ounces of guacamole, two ounces of queso, two ounces of cheese, and four ounces of refried beans, and a Coca-Cola, a canned Coke. And that's, uh, it's, and I had a, I had a coffee this morning, I had a coffee, well, at like 11, but I didn't have, it was just black, so that doesn't technically count, because there's no calories, and it's just bean juice, you know what I mean? But, so yesterday, we, uh, we, we saw that I couldn't touch my toes, well, you really couldn't see too much of it because of the angles and everything else, we're still trying to figure that out, but you know, we saw that I couldn't touch my toes, and I was like, you know what, we're going to touch our toes, that's what we're going to do this week, we're going to work on touching our toes, and... And then everybody was like, you're not supposed to touch your toes. I didn't know if you all knew this, but touching your toes is really not something you're supposed to do. It's, uh, it actually develops a whole bunch of bad habits in the body, I guess. Um, it's not even, I guess, it's a it's a scientific thing. Like a handful, a, a, a lot of people say it. Like just Google touch your toes or can't touch your toes. And you will see like seven out of the ten first videos will all be like, don't do that. So the reason that we couldn't touch our toes before is because we have super tight hamstrings. So we're going to... We're going to do complete seated hamstring stretches with Michelle Kenway, the physical therapist. This video is only 3 minutes and 52 seconds long, so we'll probably do it twice. You know what I mean? Maybe even three times, not three times. We'll do it like twice. And then uh, and then I'll, I'll be going back to work and continuing the rest of my day. And yeah, so that's, uh, that's what we're doing. That's what we're getting into. And yeah, so hi, hello. We're going to get into this. Please check out her channel. The link to the video will be in the description below. And yeah, like anyone that we're out here, you know, using their content, if we could just, I like the video. I, you know, I subscribe because like this channel, you can check the channel links. Just, 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 just go give them, just, just go give them a thumbs up or something. You know what I mean? I don't know if we're supposed to do this. <laughs> it's public use, right? We're not, we're not using it for bad purposes. All right. Let's get my Irish seated. Oh, and I fell over earlier. So, like, this butt cheek is not in the best of places. <clears throat> oh, I need you to turn, lady. Thank you. All right, you're all ready? All right, let's start this up. Oh shit. Oh shit. Michelle, today I'm going to show you how to get a complete stretch on your hamstring. Now, do you want to stretch your hind and find that you can't get a really good stretch? Or that you find that you stretch and your hamstrings are tight again? I it may never not stretch. Be you're not stretching all of your hamstring. We're going to be stretching the outside part and the inside part of your hamstring. Okay. Just bear with me for a moment before you do the seated stretch because you're going to know what you're stretching and why. Just take a little look at this diagram. And you can see that there's an outside part to the hamstring um, that's a large muscle and that tends to get a little tight. And then there's the inside two muscles of the hamstring as well. I'm going to separate the stretch and show you how to stretch out both parts of that so you get a really complete stretch. So if you take a look at your own leg, you'll see that there's two parts to your hamstring. That's my lateral tendon that comes from that lateral part or outside part of the hamstring. You can see my tendon there. And then turning around, that's the inside part of my hamstring. So we're going to actually stretch both parts of these hamstrings. So I'm going to mirror you at home so you can do this exercise along with me. Okay, so let's get started. We're going to start with the outside part of your hamstrings. I'll mirror you at home. So take your right leg forward. Right leg forward. That's in position. Now you need to take this leg straight. Okay, so straighten it out. Mm -hmm. And you're going to turn your toe out to the side. So turn your right foot and rotate your whole leg. My whole, whole leg. In that position now, bring your body around and take your navel down towards your thigh. So bend them down and forward. And this is going to stretch out that bicep. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, yeah. So you're going to stretch those parts out as you lean forward. Oh, now, all right, hold on. I need to get closer to the edge. So you can see what I'm doing with my back. 
So you can see what I'm doing side on. That leg's out in front. This leg is extended. Lean forward. Now lean forward from your hips and take your pelvis forward. You're really hinging. Make sure you keep your back straight too. Like, like, like chest out. If you're hunching over, you're not doing it. Like your chest needs to be out and lowering it. Yeah, see what she just said. Ho ho. Oh God. And like I can open my chest up. This is rough. And you can hold that stretch for up to 30 seconds. Up to 30 seconds. And remember not to bounce it. Alright, now once you finish stretching, you come back up. And now we're going to stretch out from the inside. Oh. So again, what you do with this one All right. is turn the toe, the same foot, but your right leg. Uh huh. Oh, uh, inward? Okay. Oh, I don't know if I can do that. Oh, I, I can barely move Again, that. Bring your navel forward, belly forward. Oh! Straight Straighten my back. Ha! <laughs> oh, dude. Ah, oh, it feels like my hips going to dislocate. Ah! Uh. I'm going back in. I'm trying again. Oh. So that that was that. So now we're gonna do this. Da, 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 da. Transform. Fit the screen. Pow. That's not how that's supposed to work. Yeah, yeah. We'll just make that work. We'll just make oh let's move it over a little bit before there. Before there. Uh no, let's uh <laughs> let's undo all of that. Bow. Oh, now we're now we're really wide. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Do this, and then this, and then and then put that back to the fit. There we go. All right, cool. We're okay with that. All right, so she showed us how to do that. What minute are we at? We're at eight minutes in. All right, so now let's do the other leg. Let me back up so you actually see me. All right, so leg. Ooh, let me get to the edge of my seat. Out, straighten up, chest out. Taking it straight down. Ooh. As soon as I start feeling the pain, I want to I want to throw my shoulders in to minimize. Ooh. I need to remember to stop looking up at you all. Oh wait, a little back. Foot started losing. Hmm. That's not only the hamstring, that's also like the calf. Like I can feel that everywhere. That's that whole tendo. Oh. Mm. All right. And then, oh, my hip just popped. Take her to the inside. Square up. Open the chest up. Honestly, I already don't like this. I can already feel the tenseness in my back on this one. I mean, literally already right now. I, I can already feel it right now, just at this point. It's right here. It's right here. It's right here.
like my entire hip socket. I can feel it like even up in like part of the front of the leg, like right here. That's as far as she's going. Mm. She said we can do this three times a week. So today's Tuesday. We'll also be doing this Thursday. It's Saturday. Time is it? 3.53. Hmm. I can also feel the tenseness in my back like a lot and right on the inside of the hip oh yeah super on the inside of the hip that's what your flexors your flexors your flexors Side. Square up, wide out, chest flat, chest flat, chest out, back flat, back forward, whatever. And then we're just going forward. some resistance behind the knee, but I've got a lot more range. Hmm. Alright, other side. What are we at? 100% the hip. Now I'm starting to get a little touch on the ankle. Oh, behind the knee, like in the calf, super tall. Oh, and then outside. That's it. We're gonna call that there. Oh. 15 minutes of stretching. Not even 15, it's like 12 minutes. Y'all can do that, 100%. Y'all can do that, no issue. Appreciate you for being here. I'm sure that audio was much better than last time. We'll see you back in the playback. Appreciate you greatly. Thank you so much for being here. Nothing but love, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Nothing but love, peace, peace. <laughs>